Well, my calculation says 17 hours and 37 minutes, 243 miles. Yeah, that's without stopping or peeing. Alexa, turn on green lamp. Okay. <laughs> What's up, guys? Happy quarantining. Um, I wonder how how is everyone doing? I know it's been a minute since I've been back, but I'm officially going to be back on YouTube. So please like, subscribe, comment down below on this video. I swear I've been in this for like three days. I'm going to change. It's really cold in this house, so... Uh, Okay, um, so I basically took a trip across country because I go to school in Tennessee, you guys already know that. It kind of sucked because I knew that my junior year was over and literally a blink of an eye and we were told that they were going to close borders down, so I had to leave a lot earlier than most people. All my classes were su switched to online classes and it was, it was just hard saying goodbye. I got a phone call on a Wednesday and from my parents saying like you know you have to come home now you're gonna have to try to drive to louisiana and we'll meet you there we'll pick you up and we're gonna drive to texas stop there for the first night and so that's exactly what i did but it was two days from like it was two days after so i had to get a storage unit and um pack up all my things in two days which is very difficult um so finally drove to louisiana took me around 10 hours and yeah it, it was it was not easy i was very tired um then we had to go get a trailer to hook up my car um to the rv might as well give you a tour of the place or waiting bed tv the trailer's here Can you come out and help me, yep So that took a couple um, hours because we were just waiting there for the guys to come because one of the trail the first trailer was broken so we had to wait for like the second or third trailer and then we finally did and then that's that's the one we got but it was difficult putting it together there was some issues like with the lighting and stuff and um, like the tail lights but then we got it working so it was fine after that um, then we just drove through um, Texas for the majority of the time. Um, New Mexico, um, then we made it back home to Arizona, and we're finally home, and I'm happy that I'm able to be home, but I definitely miss my friends, and it's weird how, like, you never know, like, you don't really, you don't realize how much freedom you have until it's all taken away from you, and that's one thing I've learned from this situation, like, I can't leave my house because of quarantine and like I can't go to In-N-Out Burger and sit down in a restaurant. I can't go to gas stations without fear of getting the coronavirus. I mean, I've been wearing plastic gloves and masks, but it's just like you don't want to go anywhere. And then also food is very scarce because everyone keeps buying it in bulk and it's like survival of the fittest and I don't know if I'm kind of sad because I don't know if I'm going to be back by my senior year like for college or anything I just hope this blows over but yeah I just wanted to share some insight with you because I'm all alone in my room going crazy so I thought why not make videos every day but I hope you guys enjoy this video 
I'm gonna make a little montage of my trip across country. Hope you guys enjoy. Take care.